tell you one thing. I am sick of random stranger missions. What's going on? Welcome back to the quest 100 percent What do you want, stranger? Yeah, what do you want? In strange time. Do I look like a coward to you? I mean, obviously I do, because I look like that milk sop there, but tis no matter. Can you help? Maybe. See? Even he is sick of hearing your nonsense, you afterthought of a child. I apologize, sir, for his smell. Why don't we come back here to somewhere more conducive to displays of utter gallantry and deep-seated inadequacy? Well, what did you have in mind? Shoot a bottle off my head, like William Tell. This is getting silly. Very silly. The man is a moron. <laughs> Shoot one off mine instead. Hey, I'm the brave one. I'm not scared. Uh, I'm a good shot, but... I won't even flinch. I don't want to hurt you, boys. Oh, I can't lose. <laughs> Either I'll prove my masculinity or die and be spared his company. Come, sir, please. Okay, then. <sighs> What the freak? Listen, just make sure everyone knows you asked me to do this. Of course, of course, of course. You boys are ridiculous. <sighs> okay. Shoot, sir, while our courage holds. Good shot, sir. I didn't bat an eye. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> what was? I feel like we didn't even do anything. Oh, of course you didn't. We all know you're hardly sentient at all. <laughs> Another round, smaller bottles, sir. Please. What? Uh, I don't know. Please, this creature is unbearable. He needs silencing. <sighs> I'll do what my the best. Freak? As long as she witnesses that I'm doing this under duress. Oh, these boys are so silly. Okay. I'm waiting for you, mister. Fire away. Now... <laughs> oh, he got it. Of course. Uh, there it goes. <laughs> now I'll stand on one leg. Me too. You keep shooting, sir. And this time you kill the beast. He emerged fully formed from the swamps. Helen. Silence, you blackguard. Sir, shoot the wretch. Ready? You're deranged. Shoot away, sir. My bottle and his brain. Please. At least I have... I, I must be the bravest man I know. Shoot mine. Now do one while I hop. Do one while I turn somersaults. Uh, shoot me. Oh, give me the gun. Let me shoot him. For all mankind. Uh, I think me and the lady have had enough. Oh, I don't blame you, sir. This man's tongue, I would run too if I could. Here, for your skills and talents. Mm, thank you. Now, brother, I am going to walk Helen home. Don't follow us. She has an elderly aunt, and I fear the sight of you could finally finish her off. Helen, is this creep bothering uh, you? You two, come along. Oh, no, there aren't two. There's me and the lizard man. Please, my angel, do not aggregate us both together. What the freak is happening? Okay, are you on to me? You say mission complete. Does that actually mean mission complete? We're sitting at 58.3. No, of course not. There's three more. Why wouldn't there be? Alright, so... We're gonna wait until morning. Because we're gonna hit the general store, the doctors, the arm. um... Where's the fourth one gonna be? Are you freaking kidding me? Lord? Okay, new plan. Oh, we're here. Next. I know, I'm becoming evil, it's okay. <laughs> Man, 
Okay, so the mistake was I shouldn't have went. Okay, I still need to rob two more shops, and we learned the hard way, do not do gun shops. It's like common sense, doesn't it? Okay, well, I'll see you guys in a What is going on, my fellow gamers? Welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Last time, holy cow, that's a lot of... Stranger Missions is hate the Ness. Um, I failed a couple things. We get a challenge, we did a Stranger Mission. This time we're going to just see if we can do some fish. What the heck are you... Oh. Uh, right now we're right here trying to see if I can catch a legendary fish or not. And... I did, um, already hook him. Hopefully this is the legendary fish, because you know how much fun I have with legendary fish. Over here, fishy. I don't know if this is it or not. Ooh, he gotcha. looks weird. Boy, I damn well got you. The legendary chain pickerel. Wow, I got that first try. Yeah, I you can didn't stay. expect that to happen. Oh, hi, horse. You're behind me. Alright, that's how I want to start today's episode. I will meet you at today's main attraction in one moment. So, on the way to our feature presentation, I found this one. Wait, did he not? Bob done. What's next for up at six? That's very feasible. Okay, I'm cool with that. I'll see you guys in a sec. All right, let's get the professor real quick while we're here. This is gonna have a bad time. It looks like. You don't seem overly humane to me. I think it's mighty fine. Uh, well, I think the guy that walked off actually was the real inventor of the electric chair. Yeah, he did. Professor, he had one job. Airport. 
Alright, so... What is that? Photo Studio... Rapper... Strangers for Days, we just completed our 8th mission, so... Let's go visit this Sadie. Let's go, boy. And maybe one... Actually... I forgot that I found my bear pellet, so let's go visit the Trapper, which is down here. Yeah, I found the bear pelt we're in while we're walking back here, or driving back here, or riding back, horsing back here. And I was like, oh, this works. We'll just pick this up right now. Well, Trapper needs it after all, so it kind of works out. What do you have that I can buy? Oh wait, let me sell you the pelt. Right, let's see. Sixty-two dollars is very fine. Nothing quite like wearing your best. What do you have for me? I can make it. Oh. Oh, I want the hat. I want that hat. Only the 20 Dreamcat Arizona. Yeah? Maybe eventually. I need those, and I need these. Alright. I have a hat. I did, though. Give me trick it second by while I'm thinking about it. Don't doubt it. Uh, maybe not. I know Master Hunter's the other one we're working on right now. Very wise. I can keep buying these all day, but we gotta keep moving on. Oh yeah, I need to get my companion right, too. Boss. Oh, we can visit trolls at another day. I'm a bear. That's gonna be number eight when we complete his stuff. We'll just need two more. Which one will be the legendary fish? Because we have to do the fish regardless. It only makes sense. Um, so the goal is for the this episode. I'm gonna run this person over. Just run away before they catch me. Visit Miss Sadie, who's getting a boat ready for us to invade the island of prison. I can't remember what even called. But, um, I know one thing I figured out. Oh my god, it's the bayou. Actually, let's make it fun. I gotta watch out for alligators! Okay, hold up. Where was the other one? I know this sounds very inhumane, but... Yeah, force been eight. I'm getting a lot of stuff done that I didn't expect to get done today. Van Horn. 
to Blackwater. Where even is she? <laughs> oh, I'll just meet you guys over there in a second. Miss Sadie. The thing is, Sadie, I really can't. Is that Abigail? I insist. insist all you like ain't happening. Arthur Taylor. Taylor was. She ain't coming with us to collect her husband. I... Abigail, you ain't coming. That's the end of the matter. See, there you heard him. Now let's go. But but nothing. It'll be quicker and easier with just the two of us. Plus, John will be calmer without worrying about you. Ain't complicated. Well, well, I ain't the crying sort, but I'm real grateful. Yeah, we know you are. We'll bring him back to you. Thank <laughs> you. This is gonna be Thank all I need grab guns. What guns do I have? Bold action. Okay. Alright. Here goes nothing. The place is surrounded by marshland. Should hopefully give us a bit of cover to move in close enough to find a spot and look for John. This time of day, prisoners will probably be working the fields. Then all we gotta do is take out all the guards and row our way out of there. Seems simple enough. How many times, Marston? <laughs> okay, bring us over. <gasps> we good? Uh -huh. Guys, what weapons here? You know, honestly, you should be they improved on the locks, aren't they? Now that they're right here. There's a guard up there. There's a new weapon up there. Okay, I'll follow you up. Is that the weapon I was looking for? Thank you. Alright. Where's John? Hey, I think I see him. There's a group in front of that barn, just to our right. Oh, yeah. I see two guards. Okay. Take them out, and let's go get our boy. Okay. Let's go over there and see. Okay, come on. I think one of those guards was still moving. Probably wasn't even close to that challenge, was uh. I it wasn't increased, but freaking six sixty. Gosh, she just took off. Get moving, Arthur. Come on. Will you hurry up? 
Come on, Arthur. Let's keep moving. Where is he? You see him? No. You. Mister. You know John Marsden? I, he ain't... He ain't working today. Put the gun down, lady. No. You put the gun down. Now. Where's John Marston? Uh, he ain't in the work detail today. Okay, well, I guess we'll go and get him together. Try anything, I'll blow your damn head off. You clear on that? Yes, very clear. Oh, no, you don't. Wow, this is actually on, working. Hey, why don't you apologize to the lady for pointing a gun at her? Excuse me? I said apologize. I'm sorry, ma'am. Ain't no harm done. So, where do we go? Towards the entrance, I guess. And who's in charge of this fine establishment? Jameson, sir. Jameson who? No, Mr. Jameson. Heston Jameson. Uh, is he a nice fella? Uh, he's been quite an exacting boss at times. I look forward to meeting him. They're... they're not gonna let you do this. Well, that's gonna be up to you, my friend. Hmm. This is not how I expected this mission to go, expecting, like, a huge firefight. And this is a lot easier. So, you a popular employee, my friend? Not especially. Well, I guess we're about to find out. This is not the play. No, march him straight up to the front gate. You better hope someone in there actually gives a damn about this fool. Guess we'll see. We're gonna have to shoot our way out of here regardless. Those cannons. Don't shoot! Stay down! Shit. No. Okay, friend. Be cool now. Just do as I say. Put the weapons down! Now! Is Jameson in? He's insulting me. They got Milliken. Got him and gonna kill him. Unless you bring me John Marston. Right now. You got one minute. I'm counting. One, two, three. Milliken, is it? Yes, sir. Will you count for me? I got talking to do. Uh, yes, sir. Of course, sir. <clears throat> From one or four, Oh, sir? very funny. You know, we must be at 11 by now. 11, 12, 13, Faster. 14, 15, 16, Now, hurry up. Well, this poor fool's gonna get his brain shot out. And over what? For nothing. Uh, Milliken, don't stop counting. I can't hear you. Now hurry up and bring that asshole out here, you bastards. Come on. <laughs> don't cry, buddy. I don't want to die. Yeah, I know, I know. Hey, hey, John. Oh, you too? Now, no funny business. Well, Mr. Milliken here will stop crying once and for all. Okay, today's your lucky day. Let's go! <laughs> you guys really want to fight me?
do this. Okay, we're good. Come on. Here comes some more. Come on. We're doing this more, boys. Been a while, John. You're telling me. What took you so long? I'll explain. Okay, this is what I was expecting this game to be like. Don't know? Okay, hold up. How far was that shot? Five eighty seven? God. Yes! Yes! We're running out of time, Arthur! It's okay. What are you doing? Let's go! Seven headshots in a row is a lot oh, easier than that. Oh, rescue, Marston. Uh, nice to see you, Arthur. Uh, there's some fellas coming here. Don't look too friendly. We best get out of here. Come on, boys. Let's move. I'll roll. You shoot. I'm good at that. Seriously? Let me. You... You're a better shot. Right, fine. You just relax and enjoy yourself, John. Leave the real work to them as can still handle it. Thanks. Keep them off us! Turn that boat around, or we will gun you. How did we pull this off? You know, I think I liked you better when you was all trussed up like a prize chicken. No doubt. Oh, hurry up! They're gonna be on our tails soon enough if you boys keep wasting time. Oh, that's us told, Dan. Uh, hey, Arthur. Thank you. Don't mention it. No, seriously, don't Let's mention go. it. We should get out of here quick before the law gets wind of this. So what the hell happened in San Denis? Is Abigail all right? She's fine. Jack is too. She managed to escape when they got Hosea. Hosea? That still don't seem real somehow. All them years. Arthur. He was like... Like family. Yeah, we lost young Lenny too. No. What a goddamn mess. And then we... What about the, the money? Hmm. Lost somewhere at the bottom of the ocean. What? How the hell did that happen? We hit on a boat. It's the only way out of there. The boat went down in a storm, and we ended up stranded on an island somewhere near Cuba. Cuba? Wait. You're gonna have to tell me all this again. It's a long story, but things ain't been good, John. 
<laughs> You're telling me. We're holed up now in the mountains to the north, near Roanoke Ridge, some caves there. The Pinkertons caught up with us again, and we had to move. Yeah. Seems Molly ratted us out, the bitch. So she's dead, too. Jesus. Maybe you should have just left me to hang. And... Uh, I should warn you... Dutch didn't want us breaking you out. Said it wasn't the right time, so... Might not be the hero's welcome you're imagining. So much for no man left behind. I can't stop thinking about this. In the bank, when they grabbed me, he saw it. Felt almost like he had a, a moment to do something and didn't. Dutch ain't himself right now. Or maybe he just ain't who we thought he was. Guess we don't need to worry about who's his favorite no more. Huh. Guess not. Yay, yeah, fast travel. You know, we should make sure no one followed us. That would have been the ploy. You brought him back to me. We told you we would. John! What are you doing here? It's good to see you too, partner. I meant I hadn't sent for you yet. I went. But I said that. Yeah, I know what you said. I felt different. Is that so? Yes. And? When Spring and John brings the law down on all of us, what then, Arthur? Well, I guess we'll have another fight on our hands. Loyalty, Arthur, it ain't. I had a goddamn plan! John. John. You are my brother. You are my son. I was coming for you. They... They was talking of hanging me, Dutch. They was talking. They was talking. And now they may come and hang us all. <laughs> Will they, though? That was the right play. It worked Arthur? out very well. Arthur! Oh, sorry. I was miles away, thinking of, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Dutch said to tell you he and Mike have gone to Annisburg. Something about Mr. Cornwall. Cornwall. Okay. Thanks, Mary Beth. Uh, not a good play. A lot of people. What do we have options for? Doris Leopold Strauss, Micah's in Ansberg. What? Oh, yeah, that's the guy we helped the other day. Okay. There's an Indian reservation up here. I didn't even notice that. Opens forbidden. Alright, guys, next one, Red Edition 2. We'll talk to Leopold and we'll talk to. You're telling me this whole right side's red. Dang. That's weird, because these are not... These two are connected, and usually these are connected, but they're not. We'll talk to Leopold, and we'll talk to Micah. I'll see you then.